live from the corner of 10th and Fowler. Happy to have you with us in Midtown Atlanta. Opening tip, controlled by the Jackets and Amari Abram. Transfer from Ole Miss at point guard for the Jackets. He floats it high and an alley-oop gets our night started. Tajon Claude with the easy bucket. And the rebound to Kapari. Starting lineup for the Jackets, no different than what we saw on Monday. Four transfers in, and Tajon Claude, who posted a double-double Monday night, is on his way. He's got four. Tom Campbell, the transfer from Notre Dame, logged four minutes against the Jackets in South Bend last January. And a baseline drive and finish, Isaiah Warfield, and he draws the foul as well. It was six of six from the free throw line, so we'll see if he can continue that. Seven to shoot. Harris has it knocked away, and it's Georgia Tech. Coming up with a loose ball. And Reeves, an early way to stretch your legs as he elevates. There for the board. Reeves lost his footing, but was uh, able to hold on and get the pass off before the travel violation. And Bryce Harris left alone in a two-hand flush. Jackets able to match three for three there, but need more resistance on the defensive end. And Harris is going to go to the line for another. First time we've seen him on the floor this year. Transfer from Air Force, wearing number four. Dom Campbell chiseling away on Dewana. They're banging. He's going up, and he's cashing in for two. And Howard's lead is up to six. Their largest of the night. A nice feed from post to post and a jam from Tyjon Claude. Howard, they can do this. They're one of the top shooting teams in the country. We saw, saw them shoot 50% from three on Monday, and Amari Abram three the hard way. Mentally, uh, they're led by a guy named Kenny Blakeney. Uh, due to back, in, back issues and exhaustion. We would have seen a Travis Best, James Forrest, Drew Barry team uh, attack another great team, the history. With two and a chance for three as Kyle Sturdivant got him on the forehead. The defense collapses. Kick out to Warfield. Won't go. Batting for the board. It's Harris. Strong lays it in the lead. Back up to four. Tajon Claude can't hit it from the free throw line. And some shots that were falling early, John. They're not going down right now for the Jackets. Yeah, good luck. Wide open lane. Bryce Harris. Look at this runway. It was wide open for takeoff. Shot clock does not reset, though. Campbell with five. He's got to go up with it. Trying to find a way, the shot clock resets, and he muscles his way in for two, and he lets out a roar, well-deserved. Well, it's second game of the season. It's a growth opportunity for this Jackets team. A lot of veterans out there have played minutes. They've been through situations like this. We'll see how they respond collectively. Kowasi Reeves into the lane, hangs and hits. It's batted back, Coleman a three, short. Another offensive board, and Kelly finishes this time off the glass. Gets a second chance opportunity, Warfield. Backing up, and Coleman picks it off. Down the lane. Hello, ball game. Back on an 11 to one run. And Coleman secures the board. A 13 to two run for the Jackets over the last four minutes and change. Coleman's three, buried in it. Knocks it in. Kelly gets the ball screen, weaving in, and count the basket, Miles Kelly. He's making plays. Marcus Dockery began his. Ball screen, Sturdivant trying to weave around Harris, count the basket, and that's the fifth foul on Bryce Harris. Game. Bison in foul trouble down the stretch. Coleman's tied it with 1-3 tonight, earlier in the second half. Now he's into the lane, goes up, counts the basket. He'll get a chance to tie it from the free throw line. Eyes, he gathers, he's got the height advantage. And Kelly for the lead. He's got it, Miles Kelly. 14 points in the second half. The two number ones, Miles Kelly and Shy Odom. 
Ball still with Kelly. Over to Claude. He's in the lane. And what a move, Tajon Claude. Claude looking to set a screen on Warfield. Kelly left a little short, but Claude's there for the stick back. Second chance points. Ty Claude. As Kelly hits both free throws. You got to look at those drives from Kelly and Sturdivant to knock those two guys out of the game. Just a two-possession game. If this goes quick, but no timeout. You got a foul. There's no timeouts yep. left. Immediate foul. Oh, my. Oh, it's oh almost my. turned over. Dockery tie. to tie it. It's Woo. off the mark, and Georgia Tech dodges a bullet. And Damon Stoudemire shaking his head.